cats, kittens, kitties. Pretty cat. From the big ones to the small ones. A huge majority of the digital world love these furry and sometimes furless creatures for their funny anecdotes and their strange ways. Cats today have become a huge internet phenomenon with even animation cashing in on the nation's favourite pet. Is it the R factor or the humour that we like to see? In most documentaries, they follow big cats in their grand habitats. But now it's time to look at their smaller cousins. This documentary follows five felines that have a South London flat as their own habitat. We will be following them at their level to see their relationships, their bad habits, their hunting methods and eating rituals so we can see what creature lies beneath the YouTube stardom. This is Taz, female. She is the eldest of the pack. She is 9 years old in human years and 63 in cat terms. She is known as a tortoiseshell, a moggy. Characteristically, this breed of cat has a short temper and killer instincts. She was found on the streets, skinny and shy, and now she rules the house, guarding the stairs. This is Boris, male. 6 years old in human years, 42 in cat. A typical ginger tomcat bought from a pet shop. Boisterous and mischievous, even now. The owners have had him since he was a kitten. He loves the female cats, despite being neutered. This is Lara, female. 5 years old in human and 35 years old in cat years. The owner has had her since she was a kitten also. She is a black and white cat bought directly from a local litter of kittens. Bad tempered and overweight. She has a distinct sense of loyalty to one living being, and to no other living thing. Hence, she is not the social type. And lastly, these two inseparable female kittens are Cleo and Jessie. Born 4th of July 2011 from a local litter. Young, naive, healthy and playful, they tend to create a social divide in the flat. Annoying the adults and pestering Boris, thinking he is their father. Cats, typically when hunting, like to watch their prey first, and watch their patterns of movement to capture them at the right moment. When kittens, we encourage them to build their hunting instincts when playing with them. Notice how they pounce too quickly and make brash decisions compared to the adults. Cats also have a tendency to wiggle before they pounce. This reassures them of their balance. Of course, in this environment, the cats need not learn how to hunt and instead get their food another way. They let their owners know about their hunger by yowling, pestering and getting in the way until they are satisfied and fed. In terms of drinking water, the cats in this house are fussy and prefer fresh running water and will stand by the taps for an owner to run them. Some cats are also very strange and deconstruct the view of cats hating water. Cats statistically sleep nearly two thirds of their lives. This is compared to humans who sleep half as much at only one third of their life. Although owners provide sleeping places for their cats, cats will sleep anywhere. 
Cats are light sleepers. They are programmed to protect themselves instinctively in case of sleeping outside in rainfall and in case of being in danger, like a bigger animal attacking. In this environment, however, cats are disturbed mainly by domestic noises of the humans in the house. Boris is afraid of the noise of storms and the rain. He runs and hides underneath the sofa where he feels safest. Taz and Boris have been cosy with each other for years now. Notice how he respects her and how she succumbs. Taz and Boris also like to frolic, and though this looks like a dangerous fight, this is a sign of affection between the two. Kittens do much the same. Cleo and Jess, the two sisters, also play in this similar fashion, so it does not just have to be a male-female activity. Cats, when familiar with other felines, let them play in this fashion. It also is a sign of trust and humility. When a cat is antisocial, they do not let other cats play with them and let the other cats know it. When cats are antisocial, it can stem from many psychological reasons, such as a bad past experience when introduced to other cats or feeling threatened by other cats' presence. As Taz likes to assert her dominance over the house, we can assume that it is the latter. Overall, all cats are vastly different from each other, with each their own personality and environment. The mixes of relationship among them shape who they are, as much as it does to humans. Humans appreciate cats because of their inquisitive habits, their creativity in ways to get what they want, and their ability to be trained to do human things. As it entertains and delights us, it is no wonder that these deceivingly but simple, beautiful creatures are the most searched topic on YouTube.